a beautiful day. Just had a very successful trip to Trader Joe's and Target, two stores I absolutely love, and I'm so glad I got out of the house because I obviously needed it. I'm at Chick-fil-A. It is 8.33 on Tuesday. This is me pre-coffee, but with makeup on. It's quite a sight for sore eyes, I will say. I used to wear makeup um, every day to 9th and 10th grade. Yeah, also, comment down below if you want like an addressing high school experience video, because I'd be happy to make one and um, just like walk you through like where I'm coming from essentially um I don't it used to be really hard to talk about nowadays it's a little bit more normal to talk about um but that's only because of all like the growth that I've made in the last year four years it is super bizarre I will say I a blanket if my parents are watching this, and I actually left this part in, I decided to take my car on a little, like, adventure. I don't find this that weird. I could either flip down the middle seat and climb through the back of that way. Someone just pinged me and asked if we could meet, so, um, pulling up slack right now and just make the fog move so okay. <laughs> I just held a meeting in my car so if you want any indication of how work from home is going that's how it's going I wanted to tell y'all that I painted my nails two different colors because I was I was feeling spicy <laughs> I wanted to get a 20 minute ride in because I have been wanting to work out the past three days and have had zero motivation to do so. For stuff like this, I let the art director come up with something fun. When most people are consuming social media, they look at the images first before they read copy. We are um, mid to mostly through the work day, it's 3 p.m. And I was just geeking out just now about how much I love my job. I think a lot of people with small agencies are like, but you only get to work on like one or two clients at a time. Doesn't that bother you? And I'm like, because of where, what position I hold, like I get to do all of the things that I love doing. I don't show this in the vlogs because it's emotional and not happy-go-lucky, but this has literally been my life for the last two weeks of starting a new job and not really knowing what the heck I'm doing. Then also realizing that no one else knows what the heck they're doing. And then also having comparison syndrome and imposter syndrome and thinking that like, and like questioning whether or not I should have taken a corporate job or what if I like, and then having all these like what if thoughts and then Satan comes in and is like, you suck. And I'm like, I don't suck, okay? I make dope shit. So let me make my dope shit, okay? It's gonna take me longer because I haven't used Photoshop in forever and I feel dumb because it's just taking me a long time. If you are in portfolio school, the number one thing I recommend is to, when your teacher said, or your professor says, hey, pick a client, you can pick any client you want. Don't pick your dream client. Don't pick the Nike. Don't pick the Apple or Lululemon or like well-known brand. Pick an obscure brand and make it dope. Style tips with Ellie, guys. Sleeve one, sleeve two, tie a knot, Loose knot. There you go.
at this view. It's so pretty. I love this view every time. It's just so good. Oh.